me a moment to find a place where I could actually shoot over my shoulder. It's so busy down here. I'm in Shinjuku in Tokyo, and this place is amazing. Uh, and, but, but I'm also really sad that it's my last full day in Tokyo. I leave Tokyo tomorrow, but just to Yokohama, so I'm not leaving Japan yet. But uh, uh, yeah, just thought I'd love to have a little look behind me. Shinjuku is just amazing. And uh, yeah, uh, so I'm off to go visit Godzilla. Uh, there's like a statue of him on a hotel. I'm gonna check that out. I figured I wanna do something Godzilla ish before I uh, take off. I am getting very sad. Um, I'm very happy to be here, but I'm very sad to be leaving soon. Very sad. Very sad. There we go, spotted Godzilla. Didn't even need to use the uh, map. Getting a bit closer. Cool. It's a cool street too. It's actually been pretty cool being up here and talking to some other Godzilla fans and some other people visiting. Uh, all the kids are loving the, the roar of the Godzilla. I'm hoping it'll like shoot some uh, shoot some smoke or something like that, but maybe they only reserve that for night. Anyway, uh, I feel like this is a good way to spend my last full day in Tokyo. A bunch of other stuff to see still. This kind of like ice cream on cake. All the kids are loving Godzilla, and I have my 100 yen Godzilla. Happy. There's a ringer hut right next to Godzilla in Shuju Shinjuku here. Um, I was thinking about eating at a ringer hut, but it just happens to be right here. So happy. Bye, Godzilla. It was a good visit. Take care now. Imperial Palace in Tokyo, and the moats are pretty full, and the water's looking pretty clean. I remember coming here last year, the year before, and it was low, and it was gross, and full of scum. Oh. Edo Castle used to be here, and uh, all long gone, all the buildings are supposed to be built since like the 60s. What's kind of cool, there's this guy unloading a truck behind me. You know, nothing fancy, but the smell of the wood is amazing. I'm just wondering what kind of rare tree that is or something. Or maybe it's just, you know, Japanese trees smell really nice.
Japanese construction cranes. I'd really like to know how they get them up there and then how they get them down. I'd watch that. It's all starting to make sense now. and south of Akihabara, so I'm just about to cross into Akihabara. But yeah, it's like a used book uh, district and whatnot, sh uh, stores, buildings, what have you. Every time you go, go anywhere, it's like down. everything in Tokyo is like downtown. Uh, so that was nice. I found some treasure, uh, some gifts, and uh, for me, I found a movie poster, which is a Japanese print 1971 Charlton Heston classic for, the, uh, for a Mega Man. Super stoked. So I got some shots there too. Ran into a local who walked me over to Jimbuchu, uh, and that was cool. So yeah, and uh, banking and everything else is working fine. So there you go. About to head to Akibara for dinner and then back to the hotel, do laundry, and yeah, I get ready to leave. Boo! Boo. So yeah, I'm just walking out of Jimbuchu. Been Jimbocho. Probably Jimbocho. Cho. Bocho. Anyway, uh, no offense to Jimbo Cho, uh, but, but look, uh, I'm under the tracks and there's the streets, regular streets behind me. Now I'm going to walk under the tracks, tracks, and I was kind of surprised. So I come, I come around to the other side of the tracks, I'm like, holy crap, and I'm about to turn around and show you. So yeah, I am in a different district, and oh, my poster tube is making a noise there. So yeah, now I'll just do a quick 180. And it's just crazy. Just from here. There you go. Akihabara. Bye, Aki. And I'm focus in. Sorry about the shaking. My backpack is pulling my arm. Yeah, it's hard to fix. Anyway, but there we go. to make a little note about this it's Huawei uh, booth and even inside they're very lonely sad and lonely <laughs> bye Aki probably gonna be another year before I see you again an interesting discovery there is an entrance to my train station by the other side of the train station I've never seen it before been here three times and it's right across from my favorite noodle joint, which helps me find a noodle joint in the future. And I can get up the train and go for noodles first. Easy breezy. <laughs> 